Okay. So, this is what I've kind of decided. So this... We, we got up to week eight. Or we got up to, I think, week six on stream. That's doing six dungeon runs with our newest save. Uh, I did two this weekend, so we're up to week eight. But we have a save file that we played on stream years ago. We're talking like, I don't even know, six years? I don't even know. It's been a long time ago. And I logged into this this weekend. And I was smacked in the face with a history lesson. There was, we named uh, people in this, um, in this save file after people in the stream and there was names that I hadn't thought of in years. Um, so I'm going to show you guys what, what this save file is all about. And, um, then I think we're going to rename the people after people that are watching today and, uh, continue this save file because it's, it's got like almost a fully upgraded town. We've got some of the bosses that are early on in the in the game. Oops. And the pistol. How was that? Oh, the circus is in town. To my folly. So, curse upon us all. like for example, like this is all upgraded already. We got the blacksmith all done. We've got the guild hall all done. The caravan is beefed up. It's all done. You know, so we wouldn't have to spend a lot of time farming just to upgrade the town. Um, so yeah, so I think I'm going to take over this town. We're going to take like the level fives, level sixes, all these people over here. Um, rename them after people that are in this group as we take them into the dungeon. And then we'll start to try to beat some bosses and do some harder level stuff. Yeah. So, just for anybody who's been around for a long, long time. We can see who died. This is my very first time playing Darkest Dungeon. Was was this it was a save file. Um, you can see uh, folks in here. Fox. The Martin. Rainami. Peachy was in here. Fairfire. Fomnix. Moonmist. Golemancy. Brianna. Galebird. The list goes on and on. Woldar's in there. Leo Wilde died in there. Delanta, Alaska Winter. Look at this. Fomnix, Melostar, Pooch, Morrigan, Grail. All these people died. <laughs> and this one, this one save file. <laughs> and like you can see some of the names that we had here. We have uh, Vaxer was one of our old mods. Zenkless, I haven't heard from in a long time. Abigail's here. Um, my good friend Rex. You see, Nair Bear was here. Kimberlina, Goldomancy. You think you had a character in this playthrough, Kimberlina? There you are. You, I don't know how to. I don't know how to do this. If we do, we just rename everybody. If you're in the chat now, okay. If you're in the chat now. And you see your name here. Let me know. We won't rename you. How's that? <laughs> your loyalty pays off. <laughs> That's a retro smack with those names. I know, right? So Nair Bear's here, Golemancy. So we won't rename a few. But otherwise, we'll give everybody that's watching here. Hey, it's Google Tart. Birds. All right, let me open it up. Let me open it up. Type exclamation point, pick me if you're a subscriber and want to be named after a character. And as we go to use you, we'll rename folks. Or do you think we should just run down the list and rename everybody, rebrand the whole thing? What, what, what should I do, gang? You tell me. Rename everybody or as we use them. All right, so anyway, this, this idea will at least I don't know if we'll still have enough time to finish, but it gets us a lot closer because I won't have to like spend so much time building up the town. Look at this. We have so many trinkets. Um, Where are we in terms of achievements and things to do? Okay, we beat the apprentice necromancer. We defeat the necromancer. We still have to do the necromancer lord. 
So there's three levels of bosses in every dungeon. I don't think any of them are done done. Yeah. Looks like the cove, we can go right to the final boss. The Beguiling Siren. going to be interesting. Rename. Rename all. As it's used to take less time. See, this is why I... You guys... There's never a consensus. It's always split down the middle. <laughs> um... All right, cool. So we're still going to have to do some leveling up of characters. Because we don't have... Enough of everything. Like, and I had to enable DLC, so there's certain classes we don't even have yet. Um, let's see. Sort by... Sort by level. Okay, we've got two level six Vestals. One of our level six is an abomination. I don't even know if I'll use that guy. And we have a level five Vestal too. I think probably got pretty good groups, but we're gonna need more. And of course, nobody's level three in the stagecoach. Because why would we want to get some fresh meat in there? We're a well-balanced hive mind. I know, right? That's what humans do best. All right, so what do you guys think? Is this a good idea? I did some, um, I talked to my, my son has beaten Darkest Dungeon recently. I had him sit next to me and teach me some things and get me some prepared for certain things. I took some notes on some of the stuff we need to do. Um, but let's start setting up for our first run of the day. And eventually we'll try to hit up this Darkest Dungeon. My goodness. Now, you don't have to kill these other bosses in order to go to the Darkest Dungeon, I don't believe. But i like to maybe get a little prepared while we level up and finish this off. Ancestral Signet Ring. This, do I have one of those? That looks like a good trinket. I don't think I have that. Unequip all trinkets. Yes. Yeah, I don't think I have that thing. That looks pretty sweet. You'd have to do a long champion mission. In order to get it. Ancestral handkerchief. A book of sanity. I think I have a couple books of sanity. Unholy Slayer's Ring. Minus eight dodge. Ew. Ew. Ancestral Coat. Plus 15 dodge. Plus 10% stress. Do you guys see anything in there? In any of these rewards? They're like, Bog, you must go get that. Please let me know. Tough Ring. It's a hag's ladle. All right. I think, um, I think we'll try this first. Let's do a long champion run. We're putting our level fives in. Try to level people up. Do you remember our venerable house? Opulent and imperial. The quotes in this game are so good. All right, so champion, what level people can you take in a champion dungeon? Can you take level fours? Probably not, a, probably not advised. Threes? I guess they'll let you take that. You can take sixes too, okay. Golomancy maybe? Let's make a team. Let's make a team. Nair bear. Is this near yeah, near bear? Okay, okay. Uh, we'll bring this. Let's 
somebody else that we need to level up. I don't know who that is. Senkless level three. Let's do something like this. Let's take this group and we'll shuffle people around um, and we'll try to take it out. Take level ones, what's the worst that can happen? That's a good, that's a good idea. All right, let's go. First, let's do this. Let's name our new people. Okay, we're going to keep Golomancy. Golomancy 2 and Nair Bear. And we're going to name uh, our Bounty Hunter. So type exclamation point, pick me if you're a subscriber and want to be considered to be our Bounty Hunter. Oops. And our Highwayman for this group. Exclamation point, pick me. If you've already done it, you don't need to redo it. You should be there. Okay. So our bounty hunter is... Thorny Subject. Okay. You got this, Thorny. And our highwayman is sedentary sky. Okay. Um, there's our first group. Let's go make sure. That everybody's got the skills I want. Point blank shot. Alright, so I want duels advance and let's get that all the way up. I don't know if we want point blank shot. Wicked slice, pistol shot. Definitely want the. Or do we want open open vein. By the way, comments are welcome. If you guys have ideas, let me know. I think I'm going to do pistol shot, open vein, duelist advance, and grape shot blast. Yeah. Or wicked slice. Do you like wicked slice or open vein better? What do you think? You're really good at getting your party members killed, so I'm around if you need help with that. Okay, cool. <laughs> um, actually, let's let's do wicked slice. Let's do wicked slice. Duelist advance is a good combo with point blank shot. So what I'm thinking, yeah, but I don't know if he's ever gonna get to the front front. Does plus fifty percent damage. The reason why I want Duelist Advance is because with um I was doing this this weekend, it, it worked out really well. With a Crusader that has Holy Lance. I start the Crusader in slot two and the in the uh highwayman in slot three and the two of them go back and forth swapping places with those moves. So I don't know if the highwayman will ever get to the front front. But we could try. Um Okay, so what do I want here? 
Holy Lance, Inspiring Cry. Do we, we're going to have the Vestal, so I don't think we need this heal. Stunning Blow, and then Smite. Maybe not take the one. Yeah, do that. Okay. So Nair Bear. Centauri Sky, we got that maxed. Grape Shot Blast is maxed. Wicked Slice and Pistol Shot maxed. Okay. Air Bear. I was driving my son crazy when he was watching me this weekend because when I was upgrading abilities, I was going like this and dragging them there. He's like, just click it, Dad. I'm like, but you can drag it. He's like, just click it. I'm like, no, it's fun to drag it. He was losing his mind. Kefir said, a good advice or tip is that everything has a hidden plus five accuracy, so a 95% chance to hit will always be 100% chance to hit and also works with enemies. Hmm. wonder why they put it, made it hidden like that. Yeah. All right. So, Nair Bear, we're going to be using Smite, Stunning Blow, Holy Lance, and Inspiring Cry. That's the stress heal. Inspiring Cry. Here. Holy Lance, Smite, and Stunning Blow. Okay, make sure those are all up. I gotta watch my gold, though, because it's eaten through it pretty pretty quickly here. Golemancy. These are the four I want. That's done. And then Thorny Subject. Okay, we have the ability to mark. We can do more versus mark. Come hither. And the uppercut's done. Or do I want finish him? Finish him! We don't re... Marked? Who, who combos with Mark? Oh, he does. With the pistol shot. Hmm... Charlie, you may or may not have around 3,000 hours in this game, so you played it just, just a little bit. Yeah. It tells you to drag it, so you were following instructions. Thank you, Blessed. Thank you for uh, defending me here. Maybe I don't need come hither? One does not simply walk into 64. Hi, Shavari. What's up? Keep the dream alive and hit the snooze button. <laughs> uh, you also drag the icons? Thank you. All right. I feel, I, I feel vindicated. I feel vindicated. I want one more ability than the than the four they're giving me here. Plus 90% versus marked. All right, let's do this. Let's let's keep this. So, collect bounty, mark for death, come hither, uppercut. Look, I'm going to drag it out. All right, there's our group. Everybody's got. Oh, I could. Oh, I could go crazy here. Spend a whole lot of money. Damn, we're getting low on money. You guys better not fail. That's all I'm saying. We need money so bad. All right, that's that's good for now. Holy crap! Okay. We're doing ruins. We're doing a long mission. We're going to try to get this ancestral signet ring. I need trinkets. Focus ring. Ah! Get down there. Minus stress books. So the stress, I could do... Do I have a healing something or other? 
Vestal only. Minus 10% stress, plus 33% healing skills. Plus, my, oh, it ruins just the stun chance a little bit. It's only minus 10, and you do less damage. Or I could use... I could just use the head. Let's use the head with... The Book of Sanity, and we won't get more stress. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah, this last of DLC releases next month, Valoroka. I reached out to the devs. Hopefully they want to work with us when it when it spawn uh when it launches. When it spawns. Yeah. Alright. So I think that's what we'll use with Vestal. She'll carry around a severed head. What should we do here? Plus ten accuracy on Nair Bear. Legendary Bracer to give more damage. Oh, hey! Oh, oh. Yikes! Holy crapples. Thank you, Gardener Girl. Thank you for scaring us. And for your generosity, of course. Let's get a mini for you. What's your mini of the day? Come on, come on, say hey. Um, there you go. You got a hunting cougar. As your mini of the day. Thank you so much. $15 till our next giveaway. Thank you. You like spawn way more than drop? <laughs> it's a more fun word, isn't it? All things have a right to grow. Hi, Gardener Girl. Okay, so we do the plus accuracy plus crit. Um. Fan, thanks for following. Everybody will do a lot of damage. With that. Plus 5, 25% damage if in position 1. Plus 25% against Eldritch. Plus 2 speed. Plus 8 dodge. Hmm. Still trying to wrap my brain around what these trinkets do again. Wish you can equip more than two, right? I don't know how worth these are doing. That's a bad sentence, but you know what I mean. How worth it it is for those. Seven percent crit melee skills. Forty percent bleed chance, but he's not using a bleed. I didn't put the bleed stuff on, right? We are going to the ruins, right? Minus eight dodge might not be the best. Um, Maybe something like this. Plus two speed, plus eight dodge. Minus 20% stun skill. Who's got the other anti-stress book? All right, we need another anti-stress book here. I thought I had more than one. Oh, this might be a good. Is he our scouter? Eh. Sorry, I'm being indecisive, gang. Okay, so he's got the stress book. Let's give him the plus 25% damage from this. Hit points are a little bit less. All right, I guess we go with this. The only thing I'm not happy about is this one. It's only okay. The feather. 
All right, let's do this. Long champion run, 100% of room battles in the ruins. Let's provision them. Oh my God, I'm scared. What'd you say? I did not. I would love coffee. How'd everything go at the post office? Did it? They're shipping cookies. All right, let's go. Oh yeah? But how much? Okay, I didn't care. I figured better be safe than sorry. So I was planning on just putting it in the mailbox. Okay. You know what? I'm not going to skimp on the food. All right. I hopefully come out with lots of stuff. I'm scared. Hold me. I'm scared. It's my first champion run that I've done in years. My first long run I've done in years. Oh no. Oh no. I did a long run. I got, I brought the wrong stuff. I had it on wheel to not ruins. The fiends must be driven back. And what better place to begin than the seat of our noble line. Oh, well. I was looking at the wrong thing. Did someone say cookies? Yes, your cookies are shipping today, Bowser. Uh, did you say hello? No, I think I'll it's you. Hello, but that's close enough. I think it's you. Oh, but I didn't misspeak. I think so. I think it's Demon Zafan and Bowser to end. Because JoJo won the raffle. All right, we have to do 100% of the room battles. It feels like it should be. Okay. Where are we? Oh, we're here. So we have to do all the room battles. So I might as well go up here and start it off. The sack. The sack is empty. First battle. The Bone General? Oh, God. I, all right. I had these guys in the wrong order. Um... It's a little stress between friends. All right, he is stun resistant 90. I could come hither. Come hither. Captain Rolly, thanks for following. Dodge. Yes. Holy Lance. Move forward and kill this fiend in the back. Yes. Good job, Nair Bear. All right. Duelist advance. Nice crit, Sky. Should we go for the stun? Nair Bear. Holy crap. Should I go for the stun? Stun 90%. Stun 140 base. What is that? A 50% chance? Nice. 
Nice. He's already in the back now. Okay. Next round. Well, we could hit him in the back. Okay. Quakes. I love it. I like it. He resisted the move, but it marked him. Uh, unfortunately, he can't hit. In radiance, may we find victory. Ooh, would you leave him with one? You left him with one. Oh God, ground pound. A dizzying blow to body and brain. That one hit! That one hit wrecked us! Holy crap! All right, come on. Oh, he's not, he can't hit him. He's gonna go again. He's gonna do it again. All right, we gotta get out of the back here. Yeah, ground pound, no good. Monstrous size has no okay. intrinsic merit, unless inordinate exsanguination be considered a virtue. Um, I don't think we need citrine. It's fine. 